Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Would You Rather, where we answer questions that are absolutely ridiculous at times, but somehow even I need to answer. Um, the story of my life, I guess. Well, anyway, let's get started! Until you retire, would you rather work a 9am to 5pm job or work a 9pm to 5am job? I said it correctly. I think I did the very least. I find this hard, because honestly, um, it, obviously, like, any normal job, usually, is a uh, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. job somewhere around that side anyway um but i think that if i had to choose i would probably go for a 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. one the thing is though like as, as, I'm, as i'm recording this right now it's like 11 p.m. it just have been 11 p.m. uh going towards midnight that's when i record usually and then like around midnight or 1 a.m. i go to bed and then i edit everything in the morning and then in the afternoon and upload everything make thumbnails etc etc that's style how i prefer so i do i have a bit of both to be honest um, so it depends on what I wanted to do, but I think a night shift would be perfect for me. It pays more as well, which is a really good thing. Um, but at the period, like, I was still in a typical rascal group, which, uh, was a thing, uh, for somewhere around last year, end of last year. Um, you know, that was great. That works great, actually. Uh, you know, we stayed up because some of them, some people were from, uh, Japan, and them were from America and Canada. So we, we, I, and Sven was the other person that was in, that was Dutch, stayed up until like 4 or 5 a.m. at times recording and having fun with these people talking and just, you know, doing all of that stuff. And I was fine with that, but I think I did get a little bit of a lack of sleep at the time because I'm a person that wakes up early automatically, no matter how late I've gone to bed. If I go to bed at 3 a.m., I still wake up at 7, and it just that's just not enough sleep for a healthy human being. Um, so I would have to schedule that properly with my sleep, but I think I would prefer night work. I, that's what I think at the very least. Would you rather not know how to read or not know how to write? Um, definitely writing. Uh, because when the fuck do you even write again? anymore. I mean, I think about that, that could be a problem with texting. So, didn't really think about that, that, ah. Uh. Oh, well, I guess calling it is then, back to the 80s! Or 90s, actually. Don't think they had it in the 80s. And they did. I'm lying. They did. It's not that bad. Would you rather have a lover who only speaks on Mondays, or have a lover who only speaks in Pig Latin? Um, it's oddly specific and oddly random, but I'll go for a lover who only speaks on Mondays. I guess that's just the, the, the one day we're gonna have to do something else and just stare at each other and get, use sign language and point at things like, Could you, could you get that thing right there? Could you, right, right there? I'll get it, I'll get it, I'll get it myself. Would you rather be naked all the time, which doesn't sound that bad, honestly, apart from some occasions in which I couldn't imagine that it would be kind of awkward, uh, let's say the gym, for example, uh, or never leave your house or apartment, which means that I don't get to go to the gym. I can work out at home, it's fine. Who needs sunlight anyway? <laughs> Yikes. Would you rather be stuck in a room with dead bodies or eat five spiders? Um, yeah, I'm gonna go for the dead bodies. Not eating spiders, it's not happening. You know, dead bodies... It sounds gross, but when they're like bombed in and stuff, which I hope they are, it doesn't say anywhere that they aren't, they could make some of the best company I've ever had. You know, they might actually not be mean to me, respect me as a person, and just listen to what I have to say. Would you rather be punched by Saitama from One Punch Man or face the pen and stare by Ghost Rider? I have no idea what any of those two things mean. I have heard of One Punch Man, though. Um, and since the series is called One Punch Man, I am presuming, just my spidey sense is tingling, that his punch is something rather special and I would not want to have it on my jaw. So I don't fucking know what the Ghost Rider and his pen and stare are, but I guess I'm gonna go for that shit. I have a mean stare as well, so... I could, I could, I could win that easily. If you had to dress one way regularly, would you rather be well dressed from the waist up with ridiculous pants and shoes, or be well dressed from the waist down with ridiculous shirts and hats? I mean, shoes are kind of cool. I have a couple of really cool shoes that I fancy. Um, but I guess like ridiculous pants and shoes can be funny. I, I don't know. Ridiculous hats doesn't sound like a good thing. I have one fedora which I sometimes wear. Um, I'm, you know, I'm kind of content with the style I have, I like it, so, um, I'd rather be well-dressed, uh, from the waist up, you know, fine, I'll just get stupid pants then, as long as I get to wet my awesome fedora. Would you rather have free tickets to the Super Bowl for life, or get 20,000 to never watch the NFL games ever again? 
Now, my question is, for how, how much can you sell Super Bowl tickets for? And how many tickets will I get? If I get two tickets every year, and I could sell them every year for, like, a fucking thousand bucks, then I'd be in for the rest of my life. I mean... Ah, fuck it, give me 20,000. I don't... That's, that's fine, too. Would you rather be on jury duty? Duty? Ju what the hell that is? And go to work. I think that it's like the American thing. Like, you have to go to, like, a court and actually be a jury person. Be like, yeah, well, I know how the law works. <laughs> hey! In fact, you, you probably don't. And that could be an issue, but they don't really care, or so it seems. Um, you know what? I'd love to do that for one time. We don't have that shit here in Europe. So for one time, that would be funny. You're sitting there, and you're like, all rise. And I'm like, what? Oh, you mean me as well? For sure. And I'm like, hey, yeah. What are we doing here? And then I get to read the letter. Like, it's, we have, we go into like this meeting, right? And we've got like this huge serial killer, like, like 100 people. And we're like, but yeah, what if it's not true? And the jury goes like, yeah, well, that's what the evidence was for. And I was like, but yeah, what if that's not true? And everyone all of a sudden thinks like, oh my God. We've been wrong all this time. Would you rather be wanted for murder and be on the run or be a homeless man who only has boxers? I mean, only having boxers sounds like an awesome way of living. The homeless part is where I don't really fit in. Fine, I'll be wanted for murder and be on the run. I can run pretty fast. I can hide very well. I'm very pale, so I just go to Antarctica and hide in the snow. No one will ever see me ever again. Would you rather be able to transform into anything or anyone in the world or be able to teleport anywhere in the world? Um, I think I've already answered like kind of this question before. Um, I'm content with what I look like and who I am and all that crap. Obviously not like content as in I, I, I Okay, here comes a really serious part of this question, which probably shouldn't have been the case. I real, I, I still really want to develop myself. I really want to keep learning and growing and blah, blah, blah. But I'm overall quite happy with who I am and what I look like and all of that crap. So I'll be able to teleport anywhere in the world. Um, I won't use it often because I think, uh, I mean, it does save a lot of money when you don't have to go on a plane, honestly. But like traveling to a place is part of the journey. In my opinion. So, I don't know, maybe I'll just use it off, on and off, I guess. Or, if I, or like when I need to go to like the, the grocery store, I'll be just like, I don't want to fucking drive there. Boom! And like, hey! And like, how the fuck did that guy just get there? He was sending around. <laughs> Would you rather kill your daughter to save an entire country from a huge catastrophe? Nah. I probably wouldn't. Or be the cause of the catastrophe, of the catastrophe that destroys the country? Um... I think my birth is one of those catastrophes, if we're honest. So, yeah. Whoops! Before going to school or work every day, would you rather eat a breakfast of only jelly beans or eat a breakfast of only hot wings? Definitely hot wings. Hot wings are fucking amazing! And yeah, I would eat them in the morning. Honestly. I mean... Yeah, no, I would. No problem. Would you rather have your partner have a homosexual affair or your partner have a heterosexual affair? I mean... If I could choose, I want, rather wouldn't have having an affair whatsoever because that just makes me a really sad human being. But if I had to choose, then might as well be homosexual, I guess. Like, girl on girl stuff, it's not my favorite, but I guess it could do. Would you rather fight all the original Power Rangers in their Megazord robot? Wow, I sound like a nerd. <laughs> or fight Optimus Prime? Um, I would love to find the Origiono, which sounds like origami. It's like ori it's like paper power range. I could fucking get them. Would you rather wear a ski suit all the time or go everywhere barefoot? Honestly, just imagine. Just imagine wearing a ski suit, like for one day. For one day only. Just going into like the grocery store, just like with the big with this big like that's actually diving, that's not a ski. Okay, fine, it'll be a ski suit with these like really big flick flip flops that you use when you go swimming. The fuck I don't know what they're fucking called. And you just walk in like and you just go like hey hey Good morning. Now good morning to you too. Would you rather be a student for the rest of your life or be a teacher for the rest of your life? I happen to be a student of life. I wouldn't want to go to school though, so I'd probably just skip class every day. But, you know, in a sense, I will. As I said, it's, I will always be a student. I'll be a student of life itself. Life will teach me things probably the hard way because life hates me and I hate life too. <laughs> and that's where I'm going to leave it for this episode of Would You Rather. I hope you enjoyed it more like I enjoy my life. Again, starting to cry now. So, just, uh, so thank you for your support and uh, make sure to leave a like and subscribe and all of that bullshit. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! <laughs> My arm just really can't get out of this. I, I need to break it in order to get this. Go it, My shoulder is too. Okay? Yep. Ah, there you go. I, 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 think, I think I broke something.